Cast Ranger. Four little casters, they cut home. I'm gonna buy you 22 new stories this week. Cool. 22 divided by 4. 4, 8, 12, Welcome. 6. 6.5. Welcome. Yeah. 5.5, I don't know. Welcome, everybody, to Extra Extra Cast Ranger. As I've said before, I am a man of my word. And when I say I'm, doing, I'm gonna do something, I fucking do it. So when I said I was gonna buy the and, and in this case he did and fucked so, it. So when I say that said that I was gonna buy the Tango Robo, I did. Yes. So right in here in front of me right now is my Tango Within Robo. Within range of his actual dick. With the Tango Beam. It is quite a spectacle, I must say. <laughs> you know it's you know it's funny too? I actually looked up like the Tenga itself. It's only like twenty five bucks. Well, I'm not opening any of your packages. No, I know. <laughs> well, I'm not buying one. <laughs> like, even you though, knew you, bro. No, I know. Even though someone, like, I forgot who, but someone was, was like, I think it was Kagia Dex. He was just like, he's like, lady, you can't review the Tenga Robo without an actual Tenga. <laughs> All right. So, yes, I have it. We did a review of it on, on our channel, so go check it out. Yeah. Apparently got a lot of positivity, so... Yep. You yeah. You got a lot of positivity. Episode 68 of Kaiju Sentai Ultra Ranger. That's what happens when you put sex and blurred S women in the fucking Sex thumbnail. sells, motherfuckers! <laughs> so, I gotta say, we're earing for a fucking treat tonight, folks, because we have a lot of new stories to talk about, and a lot will make us happy, but ones that'll also make us very fucking angry. I'm also... Like me! And you know I don't usually get very angry on this show. I'm usually the very happy, positive one. But I have some shit to say! You know how they always say, don't touch that dial? Well, you're definitely gonna want to keep your hands on that volume. Yeah, because remember, I'm, I'm loud. I'm gonna get fucking loud. So right. turn your headphones down, A little folks. less loyal this time. What are you angry about? You'll see. Oh, what? you'll fucking see. Well, Lane, why do you think I always dial us down to, like, minus ten? <laughs> Thank God I have automatic dynamic processing. Oh, look, it's a new Bumblebee. I'd, I'd buy it. it. I'd watch it. <laughs> Go see Bumblebee Guard song in theaters. Go buy it! Pirate it! No! No, don't pirate it! Buy it! No, go buy Bumblebee on the right. Go, go buy Bumblebee when it comes out. Yeah. Until then, sit there and do nothing! I mean, I won't, but I'll happily watch your copy. Car. You guys. That's not gonna happen! No! Deleting it! Fuck that! Fuck the Shaggy meme instead! It's not funny, and it was no, never it, funny, it, it, and when no. they reached a the fucking petition, we've reached Waluigi levels of fuck the it internet! It was funny for a little while, and then it just... Overstates welcome. The developers confirmed it's not happening, so knock it off. You're just you're pushing your luck, Scoob. Someone said they're basically just Chuck Norris jokes, and I agree. Pretty much. The, the, the sad part about Shaggy meme is that you know Casey Kasem's most popular character isn't getting recognized at all. Anyways, anymore. that's the amount of time we're giving to that. First story. Whoa. Oh, great. Good, you had to start off with this, huh? Yep. Okay. Is this the one that makes you angry? So, we got a bunch of new scans for a bunch of new Zeo forms, and just. God! So, first up, we're looking at Kamen Rider Zeo Trinity and the Trinity Ride Watch. Really? Which looks like it slots into the side and then flips open a panel into the middle of the belt, just like the Muteki gas it. So, it's literally a fusion, apparently, of Zeo, Gates, and Waz. Wait, now, they all go into one body? Yes. We don't, no, no. We don't know if this is a, their bodies all fuse or if it's just a power set based on all three of them. Uh -huh. It could well, be either. They all actually fuse out. Anyways. So, it's got Zeo's helmet in the chest. Gates's helmet on the right shoulder and Waz's helmet on the left shoulder, which leaves the fucking watch band running down the middle of his face, and it's horrible. So it's and then the watch bands of the other two are just running up the side of his head. They're supposed to look like horns, but God, that does not look good. I, I literally, I can say this is the worst Kamen Rider suit I have ever seen. And you know what my number one right. worst suit is? That's a pretty bold claim. No, and you know what my worst number one worst suit is? Deno Gunform. Uh, kindly fuck yourself, because no. I like Deno Gunform. No, Gunform is ugly. But, but now, this one takes the number one spot. 
It's it's just it's awful. I don't know what they were thinking when they made this form. Um, <laughs> hey, Ultraman Orb did it, so yeah, that, that's Let's better. That's better. See, if you're gonna do, you're also to if you're gonna do, you can show it to me all you like, but I literally cannot tell one Ultraman apart from another. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Kage Dex. Deno gun form is fucking ugly. I hate the giant fucking. Eyes. It's based on a Chinese mythological dragon, I get it. which I get carries it. balls of lightning in its hands, and that's what the shoulders are for. Yeah, that's even uglier. Oh. So bad. Did you not know that? Oh, I just knew he was. Based oh on my dragon. god! Does no one know anything about mythology? No. I just knew he was a dragon. Yeah. So if I had to make one positive thing that I like about the suit, I do like just. Zio's face in the center of his chest. I like that. I That's don't. Cool. No, I like that. That's it's cool. like he ripped off his mask like he's a fucking phantom thief. <laughs> yeah, but, I know. And like, the fucking watch band running up the middle of the head and around to the back is just a bad idea. So, yeah, this this is just terrible. I'm like, I was so... I, like, I was so happy with everything that Zeo had so far. Like, the suits so far have been fucking great. <laughs> Zeo 2 is such a fucking awesome design. I disagree there, but... I just, and then, look, I just look at this and I just immediately respond with Mune no Kawa Kazarina! <laughs> like, no, really. And then, like, he has, like... He has, like, the fucking hand, like, one of the Zeo's, like, clock yeah, the, hand the, things the, on his fucking, the, like, the side text, of his head. The, the character for the middle character of the word rider is, like, has a clock hand attached to that jutting out like a fucking hair feather. Oh, yeah, because, like, yeah, like, in the middle, that's, like, the Zeo visor. Yeah. It's, like, that little one pink line. Yeah, it's the middle character in the word rider. Oh, my God. And one thing I think is a neat touch is the text in his helmet, in his face, is three different colors to represent the three colors of their visors. Do you know what I'm actually afraid this might be? This might be, like, the fucking, like, build hazard of Zeo. And, like, if he goes, like, fucking berserk or something with this, I'm gonna be pissed. Like, I, I it, literally, if they do something like that, no. this is an insult to Bill Hazard. You know what? No, 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 no. The greatest no, fucking no, no, Kamen Rider no, no, form no, no, of all no, no, time. No, no. You know what this is? <laughs> oh, no, no, stop it. The kebab meme is dead. The Give kebab meme is dead. <laughs> the kebab meme is dead. Oh, you weren't here for the kebab meme. It was my Watch fault. Watch extra. I accidentally made the kebab meme happen by accident. It's okay. Here's my thought on this. This has to be be a movie exclusive form. I fucking better be. This uh, seems like something that is confined to a one-off. No, you know movie. what? Yes, I actually agree with Ichi on this because we did get cross build whatever for this fucking. Is, yeah, this is uh, the movie. rabbit rabbit tank tank. Apparently, forms. it's not. Uh, I don't know. It says TVCM right on there, so. I think that just means it's a. It, there are commercials airing on TV for it. Anyways, Th this is the rabbit rabbit tank tank. Form. So the Trinity Ride Watch uh, is going to be three thousand yen and is releasing in March. Yeah, that's exactly why people it's are not... saying in the chat that it's coming in the show in March. But all the article says is that the item, the toy, is releasing in March. So I'm going to hold out hope that this fucking monstrosity won't come out in the show. I, I am not looking forward to this at all. I will say that like the gold and black undersuit. Kind of looks neat, but just it is a fucking party that I would not like to be invited to here. This is the worst suit I've ever seen in my life. I'm sorry. It's fucking ugly. What's next? Uh, so now into something really fucking badass looking. Yeah, what was the sun? So, was. Well, actually, I'll let you explain because he's the Waz fan. So now we're looking at the Waz Ginga Miride Watch. Yeah, so apparently there's like a space themed <laughs> Kamen Rider from the year 3000. That's, the, that's a rumor. That's I don't a rumor. Know if that's confirmed. Uh, called Kamen Rider Ginga. 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 Uh, wait. Kamen Rider Galaxy. So he's got a UFO wait, motif, as you can see from the little oh, image. Ginga. That's all. And. Good. We don't have the full image of the Miride watch, but this actually looks awesome from what we're seeing of it so far. And it looks like it doesn't actually open because it's big enough that when you clamp the fucking Beyond Driver, it just does what it does in its state. And, and see, it's doing this. It's It fixed the complaint that I had about the Mirai watch like panel sticking out of the fucking thing. So now it has like this cool like kind of like space console yeah, kind of thing it, out, jutting out the front of the belt, and that looks good. When the belt is like activated, the side of the Mirai watch sticking out forward has like images of the planets in the solar system. Yeah, so thank you. See, this is a very nice form, and the best part is they gave him a cape, because as we all know, 
When you give a Kamen Rider a cape, it's automatically right? badass. I am looking forward to seeing this suit. Also, to answer Hellfire's question, will there be a Zeo and Ultraman Ginga crossover? Just make Kamen Rider Ginga Hikaru's actor. Yeah! Do it! <laughs> He's been on Kamen Rider before. He was on X. Yeah, he was. He was curious. He was curious. He was curious, buddy. So let's talk about the suit here for uh, Kamen Rider Was Ginga. So in the middle of the chest piece is the sun, being the center of the solar system. Yep. And if you look at all parts of the suit, you can see all the planets in the solar system because they're orbiting the sun. Oh. So they're all at different parts of the rotation. Oh, that's cute. And then yeah, he's got like UFO <clears throat> shoulders. And if we and actually... I really like the fact that like the Earth is on the helmet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fucking great. But just, like, yeah, then, this is a nice form. And he's got UFOs jutting out of the top of each shoulder, which is a little awkward, but I think it'll look good in practice. It, like, I, and we see, like, a little image of Kamen Rider Ginga here. I, I love the face, like, the eyes and everything, because it reminds you of Forze. It, yeah, it looks like Forze, and then the top of the helmet on Ginga is a UFO. It, look, it looks it like... Also, <laughs> it also kind of has the look of, like... Uh, a World War infantryman. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Like, it looks like a World War One helmet, right? That's so cool. I love that. Oh, I love that. I'm no, gonna... see, thank you. And that's probably the secret sound you found. Yeah, this probably uses that sound that beep, we put the beep, video out of. Beep, 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 beep. But uh, yeah, this looks great, and I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, no, good. And uh, I was good job. I don't know if it's true or not, but one of the rumors that I read is that this form has three different <laughs> versions: a yellow, red, and blue version. Oh, yeah. What do you think? I, I think what? I think that's the thumbnail that we have to have for Re Soldier. Different power sets. Oh, so when Gavatera's on the fucking changer. Oh yeah, when we talk about Re Soldier episode one, put that in the chat and we'll use it. Um, but yeah, I'm, yeah. Lo I'm looking forward to, if, especially if the rumors about it having yellow, red, and blue forms are true, because this is clearly yeah, the yellow a, form. As a, as a fan of space and like sci-fi and shit like that in Star Wars, like I I love this form. It's very nice. I, I can't wait beats, to see this beats suit. The fucking and the other shit, forms. that's Trinity. But now let's get into something. So we found out we finally got a showing of Zio's final form that we're getting. And can I just say? Yes. I'm disappointed. Yeah. So here is Common Rider Grand Zio. He's covered in cookies with pictures of <laughs> other riders on them. Cookies. They're cookie cutouts. So what we're looking <laughs> at, rider. it's basically Zio stealing the idea of Ghost Heisei Damashi. Except instead of the emblems, it's little gold statues of each of the 20 riders. So this is clearly based on Buddhist temple statues. And of course, keeping in tradition with his ancestor decade, he's got to have his own form on the top of his fucking like, helmet. Like, it's supposed to be like a crown, because he's the king. I, I don't think they're going for that. I think yeah, no, that's what people have been saying. It, like, it looks like a crown. Kind of. It's more based on Buddhist temple statues. Well, yeah. But they, anyways... They, they have that kind of accoutrement to it. See, I was, I'm disappointed because that just debunks my entire like wanting of just him to have a the recolored a recolored of Omazeo. You know they weren't as much as we wanted, they weren't gonna do it because a different form means more toys. I was surprised that they were it wasn't not just have enough. him be Omazeo. Yeah. Um but yeah, so it's called Grand Zeo, so people are saying that it's gonna be based on a grandfather clock. So I really hope that there's like a pendulum somewhere on the suit. Oh, that would be cool. Maybe he has like the pendulum cape. Like maybe instead, like where the watch band goes under the belt instead of that, it'll be a pendulum. Do you think it would like move? Because Zia will just come in with his swinging dick and just kill everyone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. So my opinions on this is, it's okay. I like. The... It's better than Trinity. Oh well, yeah, I I I like the the collar around it. It reminds me of Evol. He's got toaster toaster gloves. <laughs> no, the see, the gloves are cool. Those are badass looking gloves. You look like toasters. But I love, I just, I love just Forze is just like, oh, he's like and upside that, down. And then he's upside down because of his one pose. of them just doing a thumbs up? That's Kuga. That's Kuga. Yeah. That's, that's Kuga's trademark. Does a thumbs up. That's great. This seems like the most unnecessarily ornate suit design Ryder could have possibly come up with. <laughs> No, no, don't say that. They could get more ornate than this. I challenge Ryder to come up with something more pointlessly ornate. Okay, I'm actually, it's not Ryder, but 
I like that you have one ready. You know, you know, I have you know, to post well, something. This just makes me think, what if Heisei wasn't ending? And like, we got ten more years of Heisei. <laughs> so this is the, with 30? So, yeah, so yeah. for the final <laughs> form we'll ever get for a Heisei Kamen Rider, this is what we got. Let's just have a form that honors all 20 of them. And you know what the worst part of all is? When he activates the form, it says all 20 names. Yeah. So here's the Grand Zeo Ride Watch. And it's a fucking mess. I love it. It's a fucking it like mess. Like so if you, if you look just over here, just look over here. There, there's Drive. We can't see. Yeah, we see. see. Guys right there. There's Forze and Gar, there's Ryuki. We can see all their faces <laughs> like Gar's like, Gar's like, oh. So it looks like what happens is the ri all the riders' faces, they like come out of the Shut side of the man. ride watch like they're fucking shelves in a chest dr chest of drawer. <laughs> what the fuck is hey, look, waffles? Cookies. Waffles? Cookies. Oh, cookies, yo. Yep, cookies. There you go, Emily. Yeah, that's sort of what I was imagining. You know those cookies that have like stuff printed on them? Yeah. Yeah. Now the f the the grand ride watch when the faces are not extended outwards. I kind of like that design. But when you put it in the belt and all the rider faces pop out, that is way too much. Well, God, they they need to have all of them on his blade. I was yeah. expecting a ride watch with like maybe an LCD screen that like could like show all the different rider images faces. Oh, that would have been cool. That would have been cool. That would have been expensive to make though. Yeah, probably. Yeah. But it's the fucking anniversary so, final form. Mm -hmm. If you're not gonna go ham on any, if you're gonna go ham on any gimmick item this would be it this form better let him summon all the fucking riders to oh my god you know what's gonna happen mm -hmm. they're all gonna come out of the statues on his suit and, yeah and so when they're not in there the the stat the, like they're not there yeah they'll yeah. Co like come so out of the armor has, so it's like oh yeah i used to have the power of all the 20 riders now i can just summon them at will <laughs> Jesus, that's broken. See, that's the thing. What Grand Zeo lacks mostly in design, he's going to make up for in fucking ability. Cause I fucking hope so, because, God, the show's going to But anyways, we can all take from this, for me personally, that dry, or fucking Zeo Trinity is the fucking worst thing ever. God. You think Ryder can... I'm sorry that it took me so long to find this, but... Rider can get incredibly complicated as, as I thought you were about to say like Rider can get fucked. No, no, never. <laughs> Cause look what I've got. Um but the apparently idol shows go to a completely different dimension. Oh, okay. That oh, is not I like even that a, actually. That is not even a final form. I'm trying to <laughs> I'm trying to find the final form That's I, neat, saw, though. I saw. I like that. Because the thing is, they use CG so they can make it as complex as they want. So they there's this one final form that's like three times as weird as that one. <laughs> and has these giant wings that have like photos in them. And it's like, oh my god, it's so freaking complicated. How did they even design it? It probably took like three years. And then there are people who try to cosplay it. Oh, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the Grand Zeo Ride Watch will be 3,200 yen and come out in June. Sorry for being so That was just our first story. I, I might yeah, get that. I was about to say. All right, next. It's going to be a long one, folks. Oh, boy. All right, so in the recent episode of Comrade Zeo, we got a look at the Re another Ryuga Ride Watch. Or another Ride Watch. And what I'm looking forward to the most, the Comrader Mirror Zio Ride Watch. So, so, Lane, so Lane and I are going halves. Yeah, Gar and I are going to go halvesies on our own set because he wants the Rio Go Watch. I want the Zio one. Well, no, you're just like, hey, does anybody want to go halvesies on it? I just want the Mirror Zio Watch. And I'm like, oh, I like Ryuki. Well, I, I don't Ryuki. have anyone to go halvesies on because I want Mirror Zio for myself as well. Right? Well, if anything, I'll just. You, you, you want both Ryugas? I'll customize it, make it another Ryuk. Sure, sure. So they're releasing this as a evil. two pack the Mirror World watch set, which has Mirror Zio and another Ryuga. Ryuga. Uh, the set is premium Bandai web exclusive, because fuck me, is 3240 yen July release. Pre orders end on March 4th. <clears throat> oh, this is interesting. I don't think they mentioned this before, but when you put the another ride watch in the driver, it says another time Ryuga. Cool. That's neat. God. Hmm. 
But anyways, yeah, the the Ride Watch is fucking <clears throat> awesome looking. I don't know why. I just love well, I love the opposite. We'll talk more about yeah. this during RSC when we talk about Mirror's Zio's debut. Woo. Yeah, but I love it. You can actually insert into the other side of the belt. Yep. It's so good. Next. Uh, so we have official images of the ZO2 ride watch. Oh, I just I love this thing. It's so cool. I, I would like it too if it uh, you won't get. Well, that is neat. You know, I'll talk about it when we get to. So the I, I get watch, I so. get what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be like a stopwatch or like a yeah um, or a pocket watch where like you open it up and there's like the watch like the clock on one side and then it has like you know a decal or something like uh, in, engraved into the other into in the inside of it. So I like that. But no, this is fuck cool. Yeah. Can't wait to get this watch. <clears throat> It'll be released. It's uh, it actually is already out because it came out February second. Price of twenty eight hundred yen. Yep, I'll be getting it soon. And I think there was one other thing in this I wanted to talk about. I don't. Did we talk about the Kikai ride watch? No, we did not. Well, all right. So we have images of the Kikai Mi ride watch, <clears throat> which I have already pre-ordered myself. Uh, it will be releasing mid February for eighteen hundred yen base price. There you go. I got the Shinobi right, uh, Mirai watch. And it's cute. It's, it's true. He did. It's right here. It's broken. Yeah, it's broken. It got broken. No, it is broken. Oh, like power wise, I thought you meant the. No, 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 like no, I broke it. No, like the actual thing <laughs> is broken. Why? Right. The hinge at the top doesn't rotate. Like if you try opening it. No, it's because it's it's only supposed to do it when it's in the belt. So what? So why is it that like this top part didn't rotate? Because it only that only releases when it's in the belt. Oh, it's not supposed to open until it's in the belt. Yep, I know that. That's why it comes off so easily because it knew you were gonna do that. <laughs> yeah, Gar. All right, next we have rumors for upcoming Zio third core third quarter toy catalog. Didn't we already just talk about these? Nope. These are rumors. What we saw were scans of confirmed things. Oh. Confirminated things. So, are these you? are all very hashtag grain of salt. We don't know if any of these are true. Cool. But, so, uh, Waz Gemini Me Ride Watch combines white and black Waz into Comrider Waz Gemini. Hmm. I, eh, I don't know. So, uh, they, turn into, they might turn into one person? Uh, Tsukuyomi Amaterasu Mirai Watch will transform into Kamen Rider Soup. Uh, can also change <clears> modes, transforming into Kamen Rider Tsukuyomi Amaterasu. Uh, Oma Driver and J.O. Ride Watch. J.O. So, so, so you can J.O. J.O. Transforms you into Kamen Rider J.O. Seemingly an evil Z.O. Can use evil armor such as Cronus and Evol armor. I would be interested to see that. I oh, would. Uh, and then... Psycho Mao Ride Watch, which is for Zio to transform into Psycho Mao armor, which can utilize all of the final rider forms, and if combined with the singular Ride Watch, transforms Zio or Jo into Shin Zio or Shin Jo. This is way too complicated. I don't know. I doubt any of this is true because we've already actually seen Zio's final form. Yep. So the, this is likely Did not accurate. Did we really? Yeah. Do we really? Do we really? That was their really? toy catalog. Photoshop salt shakers and white wads and shoulders of pepper shakers. Sure. <laughs> Next, speaking of Omazia, we got more images of the upcoming SH figure arts. Oh, guys, so pretty. It looks so good. It's so good. I love the that Look at that. What happened to That's that a final form for Zio! Come on! What happened they to could have just made the, the black white figure. or something. Well, they're still coming they're out still with that. They're still doing the soda but, figure. But, but Oma Zio is so fucking gorgeous, he deserves his own SH figure art. This right? man, th th he deserves a fucking uh, real action hero fucking figure. Oh, yeah. I love another Zio. Basically. <laughs> I, That's kind of the theory. I bet you anything that he, it's just another Zio. Yeah. The one thing that's Look always at him. the one thing that's bugged me about the Omazio design is it's so awkward how the like big golden bandolier, watch bandolier is just like Sash. hanging on the left edge of his belt. Oh, whatever. You know what I mean? You can probably move that then. Maybe. And try and move it. Break. Like, can you even can he even spin the belt like that? I think he's so powerful he doesn't need to spin. <laughs> that's. The belt. I think that's the idea. Anyways, it's oh. We still don't have any price or release or release date, but images are nice. Yeah. Meows. Right? Yeah. Meow. Next. Meows. Uh, previously, we talked about the Amazon's Last Judgment set, and now we have a price and release date. Okay, um, go to the third picture, please. 
So, guys, I, I have I have a simple life hack for you to do and way to save some money. So what you do is you just buy buy a regular regular set of Alpha and Omega. Get some little red paint. Paint some splotches on it. There you go. You have the final judgment set. Speckle with the sponge. Yeah. No, Literally, I, all it is is just have blood on them. La I know. Last time you we talked about this, I'm like, why don't I just dunk other figures in fucking Kool-Aid? Now you know how it feels to collect Funko Pops. <laughs> That's why I don't. Also, they look soulless. The Chase version. The he one. has a few blood splatters on him. He's it. got a new hat. <laughs> yeah. So for anyone planning to get this set, pre-orders open February 8th. We'll ship in July and suggested retail price tag of 11,880 yen. Before shipping in middleman. I still want to get season two alpha. I don't see Final Judgment Sigma. That's because he's not in the movie. Sigma's dead, Gar. He's been dead since season one. Mamoru killed him. Oh, Mamoru. I miss Burger Boy. I miss Burger Boy. Everyone we love died. Um, Which was also ironic because I actually lost the pet while watching Amazons. Uh, oh, no. Yikes. Next. Woo! Sentai. Going into our batch of Ryu soldier no, stories. I'm going. <laughs> I'll just knock you out. <laughs> so they... It's the Ryu, Barney! The Ryu, the Ryu soldier cast was revealed during a stage play production of sorts uh, conference. Yeah, no, that conference. was that was cool. Yeah, so this year's press conference yeah. they actually did but, some action scenes. Oh my god, I heard the fucking changers and like the sounds that come from it. It's Fucking Gamma Revolver! No, it's Seki. No, I, you know what I mean, though, in terms of how it sounds. It, it does sound like the It has, like, a hyped-up voice, and it has, like, Samba music, kind of. And I'm just like, oh my god, it really is copying Kyoru. Speaking of Kyoru Violet, I actually have the male version of that figure. Of, cool. Of the Violet Ranger. Yeah? So what was the it? best? So, I don't know if this is actually going to be a thing, but what appears to be happening is Tiramigo actually hangs out with them in, like, human-sized form. Wait, wait, what's his name? Tiramigo. Tiramigo's dinosaur of all our imaginations. No. He fights bad guys with all of us and combines with, uh... Okay, you know, fucking hate okay, you. Okay, you know what we're doing? The thumbnail's going to be that picture, but Tiramigo, it's going to have Barney's head on it. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Here you go. And then if we if they if they ever have the other ones in mini forms, so we just have to have Baby Bop and BJ. <laughs> <laughs> BJ. Uh, <Yep. laughs> no one ever noticed when they were kids. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So uh, let's so talk about the cast. What's all right. His name? Her, but derps. All right. So we got Hayato Ichino. <laughs> say as you know, say you know. Sir, you are not allowed to say names. No, you're not allowed to say names. Okay, fine. Can I at least say the Sentai name so I can say? Sure. Yeah. Hayato Ichinose as Ko Ryoso Red, aka the Brave Knight. This fearless Brave young man is a combat genius with a curious and bright personality. While training to become a Ryu soldier under the eyes of Master Red, Master Red, the Dr the Druidian attack, and he is Druidon. Oh, the Druidon attack, and he le. He, he is Lee. He is Lee. Lee's Lapped. home with friends. <laughs> Melt and Asuna. Wait, his name is Melt? Yeah, Blue Ranger is Suna is Melt. A.K.A. the Wise Knight. He, he looks like Wataru with a dyed hair job. He is a young man he with just looks like water. endless thirst of knowledge. Wataru? Yeah. <laughs> but falls short compared Not to his friends. Way. Ko and Asuna. He has a photographic memory and never loses to an opponent. He takes new things slow. And He's probably going to have a character arc where he loses to an opponent. <laughs> he is unsure of his feelings towards actual battle. He envies Ko's straightforward approach. As long as Ko isn't lucky, we're good. Right? Uh, Ichika Osaki as Asuna. Ryuso Pink, a.k.a. The Robust Knight. Grew up in a house of nobility. So it's just Ami again! <laughs> she is in... <laughs> wow! <laughs> she is the strongest member of the team. You know her well! Oh, she's also the only female member of the team. So yeah, far. Oh, <gasps> Yeah, what if, what if the Six Rangers just a fucking girl? I want that so fucking badly. Just, just mic drop. Alright, next. And... Wearing a clearly Link-inspired green tunic. Yeah, yeah we got Toa like and Bamba. In which, as in Baba, yeah, Baba Bamba, Baba Black She. Oh fuck! Oh my god! That is not on purpose. That's a coincidence. No, no, no. Okay, so <laughs> that's no. I will shot better than that. Uh, Yuito uh, Obara as Toa, aka Ryuso Green. Yeah, Ryuso Green, aka the Gale Knight. Wait, Night. the guy's name is Overdrive. Yeah. No, no, he's no. he was in Overdrive. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed the name first, so I just thought it was yeah. Overdrive okay. as Toa. Overdrive. 
Why? And then Rio so like, is that a stage name? Rio so black is the majestic knight. And the best thing about uh, Rio so green and Rio so black is that they're brothers. And the actor playing Rio so black is Tatsuya Kishida. Who? I don't know. I don't know. He's a tall motherfucker. He's like Gosei Blue. Black no, Bamba. No, he's like Goshi from Zero Ranger. There's your other dinosaur fiend reference. He's the tallest member. Apparently his combat skills has reached the master level. Oh. Oh. Uh, and Toa is a man who refuses to def- to be defeated by Ko in talent. He is he has unbelievable speed, but he has a staunch. Yeah, he, he has a staunch passive. He has a stench and refuses to use a hundred percent of his abilities. So was he Shaggy? <laughs> <laughs> he actually, even looks like Shaggy. No, like so. yoink, like yoinks to you, Gareth. Yoinks. Yeah, I'm like you're so green, dude. <laughs> No! So, come on, screw up, let's I, go feed some dreamies! Come on, dear oh. Eagle, let's go! No, no, every time I do Shaggy, I just keep going to bo- uh, Skull. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> Next. Oh, we got side characters. Oh, no. Why? <laughs> Mana Kinjo as Ui Tatsui, a girl who first encountered the Ryu soldiers. Okay, so I like the, her hat, so she's comic, adorbs. So the comic relief non-ranger character. She's adorable. I like her hat. She's a do- she's got a new hat. <laughs> Mitsuru Fukikoshi as <laughs> Naohisa Tatsui, a paleontologist and Ui's dad. The mentor. Oh, God. Ui. We're gonna have to listen to everyone say Ui all season. Ui. Ui. Masaki Tarasoma, aka fucking Kintaros, as Tiramigo. Wait, so it talks? Yeah. What? So Tiramigo is voiced by goddamn Kintaros. Or he Dan for Naruto. Class. I hate you. Wait, 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 wait. Joji Takanaka. From... Naka? Takanaka? Joji Nakata. I can't see from, from here. From Choji Sentai Live Man, Fate Stay Night as hey. Tank Joe. A Dru- Tank Joe? A Druidian tribe general who commands an army of foot soldiers called Doron Soldiers. Where have I heard Doron, that name Doron. before? And then we have Ryoka. Maybe you're thinking of Jimmy Nakata from Double. No, no, Live Man. Like, who is he from Live Man? Uh, it's I'm a Sentai. Looking. Uh, yeah, Shirishi. it's my favorite sentai, so <laughs> Hay- I should know. Hayate, the combat butler, skit dance as Creon, a Druidian tribe general who has the p- power, the poster, the poster, <laughs> the power to create monsters called Minasaurs. I've, I've also seen that translated as oh. dinosaurs, like the word minus. Wait, wait a minute, he, wait, he's a villain? Oh, that's yeah. cool. Yeah. He was Professor Bias. Oh, like the villain? He was Endgame. Oh, sweet. You are, I think you're Professor Bias. He, he... <laughs> there you go. He's one of the generals. <laughs> the monsters using posters. No, 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 no. Now you got, now you got Photoshop it to be Salt and Pepper from Blue's Clues. No. Yes. No. Next story. And the book, oh. and the book is Paprika. Anyways, love it. We have our first look at the Druidon tribe from Ryu Oh, Soldier. I love the pink one. Yeah, no, the because, x looking motherfucker. Because, because he. Gee, I wonder which one is Tank Joe. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm sorry. Am I allowed to be yeah. a dumb no, go ahead. nerd? Um, only if it's okay. Yeah. Um, I think that if you look at him closely, like if you zoom in, on Tank Joe? No, on the other guy. I don't know what his name is. Is that Crayon? Uh, I think so. The Hold X, on. the X Save motherfucker. The smaller, yeah. So yeah. the heavily armored generals Tank Joe. The smaller green generals known as Crayon. Which they're not Endgame. Oh, his name's Crayon. Uh, is there a na- is, get it? Because he's I don't know. No, they're is no, there it's just those the, two. Is there a name for the mooks? Oh yeah, oh, the, yeah. The, the Doran soldiers. These are awesome mooks. Look at these guys. Oh, they're like knights with checkerboard shirts. No, you know, you know what they look like? They, they look, look like, like teeth. They, no, they look like uh, uh, conquistadors. Conquistadors. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's no, they're... yeah, because of the helmets. Yeah. But but no, I love those helmets. It oh. reminds me of the judges from FF12. If you look at their shields are teeth. Yeah, they look like... We make like, holes in teeth. <laughs> we make <laughs> holes in teeth. Get it, creeps. Get it, because dinosaurs have teeth. Oh. Yeah, but those are humans. <laughs> uh, but yeah, oh, look at him, he looks like he's wearing boxers. No, him, he's got Sora's shorts from Kingdom Hearts. With that, with that design, if you look <coughs> at his, his head and those, he's pretty clearly based on a, a, bleeding, a bleeding tooth mushroom specifically. Ah, and when she's, Whoa. When she's she, a type of mushroom that has small holes in it that looks like looks like, like cherry jelly. It's like that, but yeah. but it's um it's like it's, it's, it's colors it's Kandira different color set, kid. but otherwise that's what it is. I think it's funny that Crayon looks like he's a form of Sora in an uh, in a weird Disney game because Tank Joe absolutely looks like a heartless. <laughs> well, well, I lo- apparently Crayon will be the one that will make the monsters grow. Yeah, and make so the monsters. He's luck- 
He's Luck Hero. He, he's Luck Hero and Candera's long lost Ken- child. Candelera. Yeah, Candelera. And meanwhile, Sorry. we have we have this guy in the corner here who's probably the first monster of the week. I love the drill. That's like a horse face, bro. It's, it's that's, like a, that's awful. It looks like a ram, but like the face of the ram yeah. is his whole no, body. No, so. I'm sorry. That is cool. I it's interesting. I like it. I'm not a, I I've never been a fan of like the the faces on the chest thing. Mr. So I guess you didn't oh, like Gurren Lagann. I've never watched Gurren Lagann. Oh, Beast Wars. Get on that shit. That's different. How they're, is that they're, different? Because their head is they're on their where their head should be. The, I mean, when their face, their head is actually the ch- their torso. I don't like that. Yeah, I've never liked that monster. So. It's hit and miss. Oh, Kavya X pointed out. I didn't notice. It's what? a unicorn because it's got a horn. Well, I thought that it was, was a, drill. That was a minotaur. And it's got and it's. And it's got a it's got a rapier, so Ooh. it's a unicorn. Thank you for pointing that out. Is he the last unicorn though? Uh, probably. Well, he's alive. <laughs> Not for long. Oh, next news story. All right. Ooh, Ryu soldier opening and ending yeah, theme song. Of course, songs. they're getting an ending. Hooray! That was, that was my big worry was that we'd never get well, ending. No, songs. just yeah. I'll say it yeah, once and I'll say it. it again. The reason why Luke and Ranger and Pat Ranger didn't have an ending was because the they had two opening themes. No, they didn't. Why yeah, they didn't, did. Why didn't the, they make the, it? The was, song wasn't any longer because it was a no, kit bash of two songs. No, but it's, they put the money. Towards, oh, you mean like, from a budget perspective? Yeah, like a budget perspective, they made two full opening themes for each team instead of having one full theme and then one ending. Uh, anyway, uh, so the opening theme song is obviously called Kishi Ryu Sentai Ryu Soldier and is being performed by Tomohiro Hatano, who did the Q-Ranger opening. Okay, I, I like the I like Lucky Star. It was a good opening. And uh, the ending theme is called Kebom Ryu Soldier. And is being performed by Sister Mayo, who did the ending for Magi Ranger. Yeah. Magi, 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 hello. I like it. Magi, Magi, Magica. Magi, Catafalls. I love the Magi Ranger music. Same. Especially the opening. Yep. I seriously oh. need to watch Magi Ranger. I mean, oh, yeah. My, my favorite sound. song from Magi Ranger will always be Magitopia. <laughs> The first oh, Sentai oh, I watched oh, like oh. as like in its entirety, and I loved it so much I marathoned it in a weekend. Ooh. I marathoned it in like a week, <clears> I think. I got a magic phone, but it doesn't open very easily. My whole Sentai. Yeah, I love that video. Magic Ninja. Ninja. All right, We're next. Gonna do the Spider-Man logo. So we have already our first image Im- information regarding a Ryu Soldier campaign item. Ooh, need it. So this is called. Ooh, need it. This is called the Hajimari no Ryu Soul, and Hajimari <laughs> means the beginning. Oh, that's cute. This is an amber Ryu soul that represents a Ryu soul without Kishi Ryu energy in it. Get it? Dinosaurs, amber, Jurassic Park. Yeah. That's that, that, not, that's 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 chaos theory. It's chaos theory. Uh, so cool to, to obtain this item, <coughs> fans need to say the special password Ryu soldier in any participating toy store. All right, oh, I'm gonna go. To only elementary there. school children are eligible to get this item, and is limited to one per child. So now I expect to see all of the fucking Toku Toy Store minute or middlemen borrowing <laughs> children in order to obtain this item to sell it. I mean, so I'm gonna try to I, get it, I, but I don't know. I mean, we're watching. You have to Tokusatsu. borrow a child to, to get it. Wait, why don't we ask Dave, we need your we need yeah. your child getting skills. We need to enlist the help of Damian. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's like um, don't get from, that. no, it's like from Futurama with Bender. Uh, I'll help you for your firstborn son. I'll be right back. <laughs> I knew you'd come back. Just here you go. Drops kicks him into like a vault of acid. Yep. <laughs> that was dark. But uh, the the Damian joke is from Tokusatsu Gaga. Gaga. Uh, okay, Gaga. Okay, well, I haven't watched it yet. Gar and I have been watching it. It's so good. I know. It reminds me of Kaiju Club. In which why is it up the form Kaiju Club subbed? Come on. The freaking fan subbers are coming back to do B Fighter, but apparently their other translator is busy. Yeah. It's bullshit. So the race is on for the Hajimari no Ryu Soul. Cool. Next. Meow. Uh, the series hasn't even started yet, and we've already got rumors regarding the Sixth Ranger. Well, we always get scans of the Sixth Ranger before yeah, this even is the not show news. starts. Yeah. Before even the Ninja fucking started, we got like Star Ninja already. Before Zoo Oger started, we got Zoo World. So oh, before yeah, Q yeah, Ranger started, that. we got freaking uh, Ryu Commander and Togama Sky Blue. Yeah, but we didn't get Ho Soldier. Yeah, but we yet. yeah. No. Because when you guys were saying, um, I missed when uh, 
Lot one six rangers works over a gold. All I could think was, oh, soldier was another red ranger. Yep. Yeah. He was only like two before. Well, when there's 12 rangers in a team, there is no actual six ranger. So according to this batch of rumored toy releases for the April, May, and June, there may be a gold Ryu soldier. You <sighs> sold gold. Of course it's gold. It, they're based on knights, so a golden knight makes I, perfect sense. I, per, I, I and I agree with that, but like personally, I'd prefer a different color. That's why, I like, that's why, I like the Tokyo Rokugo was orange. So I mean, different. I don't like orange that much, but well, it's I, fine. I, I like how, because because of the rainbow and such. Yeah. And then Star Ninja because he's American. And also listed in this post is uh, releasing in April. They will do a set of all five of the main Kishiryu as the Kishi Ryo Five Nights set. Uh, and then they will also be they also there's also an unannounced Kishi Ryu named Dime Volcano, which is obviously a Demetrodon with the ability of a volcano. Sure. Oh. It's unclear if that's gonna be Ryu Soul Gold's like partner Zord. Nah uh, zero it's six. It's probably time. an auxiliary. Yeah. Since it's wait. releasing a month before Ryu Soul Gold, probably not. Oh wait a minute. If they if the Zords talk, is this a reference to Gohanger? Probably. If they make annoying catchphrase onomatopoeia noises, for sure. Probably. That does really fucking annoying. Pata pata. Bali bali. Ganga gang. I give up. Fuck off. Yeah, bear. Sweet. Sweet. Uh, uh, yay! If, if the six ranger ends up being gold, that's fine. We don't have a freaking yellow ranger, so it makes up for it. They're gonna make him shiny as fuck. I, I just hope we get. I, I just hope for the next Sentai, they're a bit more creative with six ranger. Yeah, and it's not mentioned in this posting, but one of the other rumors regarding Ryusou Gold is that he will change using a gun changer and have his own sword weapon. Yeah, of course. So it's fucking Kyogre Gold. Yeah, and uh, eh, to the, also to that point, apparently his suit is going to be both gold and navy. Just like Kyogre Gold and Shinken Gold. Motherfuckers. <laughs> they are playing it safe. Hey, if this is there, if this is playing well, it safe, then like well, I said well, before, tuck me all the way in. Th think of it this way, Lynn. <laughs> I'm snuggly. No, Lynn, think of it this way. We're playing it safe this year, and then 2020 is the 45th anniversary. It's true. We can make so much money, we can do whatever we want for our big 45th anniversary. That's true. Four, four three centimes! <laughs> Each Sentai comes from... Now there's just no opening anyway. <laughs> All right, next news story. Uh, Sakuya from Patch Ranger is releasing a photo book. Oh, I'd buy oh, it. Oh, oh. Yeah, I know you would. <laughs> Sakuya lover. Hey. So his his actor's name is Ryo Yokoyama, and the photo book is just titled Ryo after himself. Ryo. And will feature photos of him in his hometown of Kanagawa, as well as an interview about his acting journey so far. What do you think of Sentai? Oh, I fucking hated it. <laughs> <laughs> That's part of my dark history. Yikes. So this is weird. Pre-orders via lottery will start February 7th. What the fuck does that mean? So you have to Regu earn it through a lottery. <laughs> you pay us money, and if you win, you get the book. <laughs> also, I heard that the Ryuki signature is now sold out. Yeah, that was a while back. Wait, if Umika's actress releases a photo book, Gar is going to just tape all the pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Umika and you ship Umika. Oh, fun. yes! Yes, I want. I shipped him so hard. Uh, they were so adorable. Uh, I shipped Sakia and Noel. No, no, no. You know what? <laughs> Noel was best friend. He, he helped. No, he's best wingman. He helped Sakia. I ship Kyrie and Keichiro. All right, you know what? After that, next news story. Ship Kyrie. And Anyways, the actual pre-order start February seventeenth, and the photo book will be releasing on March twentieth. Blah blah blah. Next. Premium band. Speaking of Goanger. Ah. Premium Bandai announces Goanger ten years Grand Prix merchandise. Grand Prix. Prix. I know it's Grand Prix. I'm being an asshole. Oh. I don't know. I uh, used to think it was Grand Prix when uh, I was. I, I thought you were my coworker. Oh yeah, next <laughs> week. Like oh yeah, next week we're getting Attila. You mean Alita? <laughs> Attila! Attila! Battle Angel Attila! Attila the Battle Angel. <laughs> I watched that! And I have no interest in actual Alita. I'm gonna go see it. It looks good. 
I'm gonna get some graham crackers. <laughs> I want to see Astro Boy, but with boobs. Astro boobs. Sorry, she's terrifying. When they gave it live action actor Anamu eyes, it's yeah, such a but terrible the thing look. Is like it's it doesn't even make sense Ooh. because it's just the art style that everyone no, is drawn in. You know what? I would buy the tote bag. I All like right. the tote bag. Can so, we can we get uh, Sosuke's coin? Well, not his coin, but there's a replica of his necklace with the G mark. What about the coin? With a red synthetic ruby. So you be like, oh, I'm fifty nine thousand nine hundred. Just get an actual yen coin, you goof. No, he has a Go-Wander coin. Does he? Yeah, yeah. it's a special yeah, Go-Wander coin. Anyway, yeah, so they also have, yes, a tote bag tote made of 100% bag, tote cotton. Bag, tote bag, cotton. Yeah. That's totes awesome. It killed Fitty Man. <laughs> <laughs> it killed fit, It killed Fitty Episodes. <laughs> Did that mean title of the episode killed Fitty Episodes? Sure. Oh. Yeah. Uh, and then also there is a shirt made of 100% cotton with the Go Under logo and the words Go Under 10 Years Grand Prix on the back. So what uh, all the directors got. It, it, the shirt with the, all the emblems honestly reminds me of the fucking K-Touch. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <It does. laughs> and finally, and mo I think most interesting, is Go On Red's jacket. With nobody else's jacket? Zero out of ten. No, because right? so Sosuke. Speed the, King Sosuke. Yeah, mock full Speed force. Speed King Sauce Uke. <laughs> so what you're oh, saying no. is he's an Uke, not a Seme. My ten, full... Ten points for those who get that joke. Uh, My full Speed Sauce. So. <laughs> My <laughs> full Sea <laughs> Sauce. <laughs> What's that joke with the fucking door text that's read the wrong way? Oh, it's like, um, don't open dead inside. But That's it. But people are like, yeah. don't dead open inside. inside. Yeah. That's it. No, that's how it's, it's written. And then in the movie, the parole officer, instead of it's it's Kirsty get in because it's written on the side, it's it's get Kirsty in. And then they realize. My full speed sauce, Chef Force King Uke. Lava test das males. No, Sosuke don't yamate. King like, uh, no King uh, King Uke. So he, he's a bottom. First, first. <laughs> Next. Oh. Also, re-release of Gokaiser cosplay items because the superhero battle royale thing. You yep. could get Joe's no Marvelous's cookie. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so Lu wrong. Luca's coin necklace and coin ring. Captain Marvelous's leather metal bracelet. Can, can I just? Can I get a replica of Luca, though? I'll get back to you on that. Okay. Uh, Captain Marvel's leather metal bracelet, his black leather bracelet, his red Captain ring, his tusk necklace, and his golden keyhole necklace. Jesus, is he a freaking Final Fantasy character? I mean, basically, he's a space pirate. What do you want? There you go, Lane. You can get a gold coin like that. No, thank you. Oh, God. Yeah. That, de that definitely doesn't look like a dick. No. <laughs> Um, Talk about it, using the Keyblade. Oh. That will unlock the greatest treasure in the universe. <laughs> the Dark Ring. Okay, okay, what is that? Uh, Captain Marvelous Golden Keyhole Necklace. It has the words Captain Marvelous engraved on it as if written with nails. Oh, yeah, I see it. That's cool. Nice. Oh. I always wondered why he carried that around. It's like because hey. he's a pirate. Because he's got backstory. Speaking of which, what we're having the Aka Red. Uh, next anniversary. Oh right, forty yeah, fifth anniversary. Oh yeah, the Zuoder. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Animal he'll, Wars. He'll show up next year for the forty fifth anniversary. Yep. Has next. It, has it I, almost been five years since Zuoder? Well, no, it's because I would love for there to be an Owl Blue. 40, 42, oh, yeah. 43. That's true. I want so bad for there to be an Owl Blue. <laughs> it's aqua blue. Red blue? No, ow. Ow is no, like blue, blue blue. So blue blue. Yeah. No, because yeah. he said aqua blue. Ow. Well, yeah, because aqua red Thank stated you. that there is no such thing as owl blue. It's aqua blue. And this question him. It's like. Oh, did they say that? Yeah, that was in oh, the first special. He's like, I'm oh. aqua red. And he's like, if he's aqua red, there must be an owl blue. No, it's aqua blue. Fuck. They don't say anything. They just blink at him like. All right. You're fucking crazy. <laughs> Next, we have our first look at Power Rangers Beast Morphers toy line. Beast Morphers. It looks pretty derp, good. Derp, new toy toys. Yeah, we finally got some new toys. Uh, yeah, best yeah. me. Hooray. 
So first off, we have the Beast X Electronic Saber, which is all which is the sidearm that that's, they'll have. That's so cool. I don't like it. Wait, you don't like the cheetah roaring a fucking energy blade out of it, its mouth? It's it's roaring lightning. <laughs> well, my question is, as someone who hasn't seen Go Busters, I need to know how much of this stuff was actually. None that is not, is not in it. None no. of this. None there, of these okay, things were okay. not in the show. So Emily, this is going to come to a bit of a shock to you. So their weapons that they mainly used in Go Busters were. A pair of binoculars that turned into a sword. They like fold outwards and extend into a and sword. And a camera that turns into a gun. Well, because they're spies. Exactly. Yeah. They're spies. And, and, that, and that what did Bandai of America? Say? You know what Bandai of America said to that? What? Well, there's not enough toys that we. Yeah. Could. So that's why we didn't get Ghost Ghostbusters. 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 We didn't get <laughs> Ghostbusters because they're like Busters we can't we can't sell these. And, and then and then what's Hasbro doing? New, like new stuff, new stuff, new stuff, new stuff, everywhere. New stuff. All right, yeah, and there's much more to go, so we gotta keep going yeah. to this. Wolverine claws, the cheetah claw, which looks like it was ripped out of Geki Ranger. Wolverine. No, it reminds me. It reminds me of one of Tiger Conrad Tiger's claws. A little bit. That's probably partial inspiration. A little bit. Though. And then something that looks like it was ripped out of Turbo, the Cheetah Beast Blaster. That's cool. So these I, are all it looks like it's it looks like it's holding out its hands with, with like the barrels on it like for you master yeah so wow. this is all this is all original yes yeah well except for one of these things and that is, oh it's yeah that because it's the binoculars yeah oh, it is. It, oh. they, they changed the design a little bit on this one also somebody okay, somebody wait. noticed that they actually removed all GB like all the GB logos of course. Like, Actually, I'm I'm not sure if this is the Beast X Saber or if this is the Beast X. Saber. No, no, that's uh, that's the Cheetah Blade. Cheetah yeah. Blade. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, cheetah it's, blade. it's not listed in this list of toys. Yeah, yeah the Anyways. Beast X Electronic Saber and the the yeah, it only lists one sword oh, weapon. Okay. Oh, yeah, but what's cool is they're also putting out masks of red and blue with like actual translucent visors. I, that's I, nice. I am sorry, but. Come on, where's yellow? It's right? A, it's a three-man team. Stop disrespecting the women! Well, not even that, but it's only three members, guys. Come on. <laughs> not until Beat and Stag show up. Yeah. Well, you know what's also... Hey, you know what I'm at least excited for? Hmm? Wait for each of you to go to the next new story. Yeah, new figures! <laughs> Yeah, so we finally oh, got the thing. I can't wait to get the Marvel. So we finally, oh. so we finally got the thing that we've been waiting for is the figures of the Rangers and the Morpher. This kid looks excited. <laughs> Apparently, it actually works when you say it's Morphin time. Yeah, it's voice activated, and it's voice activated, it's motion activated, and it takes a new key system. Yeah, so it's not a button anymore. Oh, so is that not... That's totally original. The design, we're looking now at the design of the new Morpher, and they've taken some liberties with the rotary part of the, of the Morphin Brace. The one thing I never really liked about it was the sunglasses popping out, and sadly, that's the thing they decided to keep. I like that. Like, on, oh. like to this day, the Morphin Brace is still my favorite Sentai I love here. everything else about the Morphin Brace, but the sunglasses just being there and folding out is the one thing that I didn't like. You know what? I think that's a good compromise with the whole, like, button with the key thing. Because, like, like, like you guys said, with the Morphin Brace, there was the whole dial thing that, like, it activated different sounds. Yeah. So, but, I, so I think what's happening here with this system is... The, the Morpher has sounds for all the rangers in it, and the way to activate them is with these keys, and the keys come with each of the figures. Because if you look at the shots of the figures, it, these are the keys that it yeah. comes with, but they also can be equipped on the figure like That's arm blades. That's actually really cool. No, and okay, let's just get into these figures. They look great. Oh. Like, I like the shiny plastic on them. The uh, detail's okay. nice. They're skinny. Yeah, yeah. Like, they're actually, like, properly... Proportion. We finally have American Power Ranger toys that aren't muscle bound or have big boobs. And then we have, which was a surprise. Okay, if you know what? Down. I, I will at least admit it actually took that long. I, I wish they came with an ab crunch, but you know what? Lightning figures. Oh, even the mooks come with a the key. Mooks, That's really the curious. The mooks look fucking awesome, which are apparently called Tronics. Yeah. Why are then, the odds that the first Hasbro Power Ranger show the mo the robot mooks are called Tronics? <laughs> and then well, it's if, like electronics. And then if we go down, <gasps> look, it's Darkbuster. Uh, Cyber villain Blaze. Yeah. 
but Spice still. And, and Blaze is now typing. The entire Sentai. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> the, the entire Sentai fandom was just well, in like joy because we we're finally getting a figure of Dark Buster. Which, if you've watched Tokume Sentai Go Busters, literally Enter turns into Dark Buster for like. Not even half an episode. Like, he does it, like, once. No, it's like, I'm genuinely impressed if they're going to be using him in a bigger capacity. And I noticed on the figure, like, it's probably due to, like, a detailing thing, obviously, but I noticed on, he doesn't actually, on the figure, he doesn't have, like, the enter eye marking that well, know, it's was a, on it. it's a toy thing. Yeah. Like, their so, toys can't be perfect. These like, aren't SH figures. Still, for a freaking six-inch, like, basic, like, $10 figure, that's really I nice. Think I think they're five-inch, aren't they? No, they're no, six they're, inches. They're six-inch. Oh. My only minor complaint about these figures... Aside from an ab crunch, but I'll accept that because we'll get we'll get an ab crunch in the lightning figures. So I'm super curious because oh, hang on, guy was facing. Oh, yeah. Sorry, it's uh, it's with the waist area. Like you can tell, they don't have a waist, and their legs aren't going to be able to go like inward and outward or left to right. Oh well, yeah. Maybe. Oh we'll yeah. We'll actually go down to blue quickly. Other, okay, yeah, yeah, they can. Never yeah, mind. Yeah, they have a waist level. It doesn't look like his waist level. Well, no, not the waist level, but the leg thing. You know what? Yeah, they do. <clears throat> they do have that. The legs have a bit a surprising amount of articulation to them. I am shocked because of, like, the five-inch stuff from, like, all the other properties looked like bleh. It's just great that, we're, like, once they release Beat and Stagbuster, we're finally going to get the figures we've deserved. We've, deserved we've been them. needing. Yeah. We've been wanting figures of Beat and Stag. Because we got figure arts of the three main go -busters. And the buddy roids. And the buddy roids. But we never got Beat and Stag. Which, yeah, I can't wait to get freaking figure, see figures of Cheetah Nick, uh, Usaga yeah. Les, and Kurosaki Banana. Banana. Or um, Chase, Smash, and Groove. Yeah. Their, their names are. So mm -hmm. what I'm looking forward to the most is seeing if these keys are uh, have more of a role. Because the figures each come with the key for that ranger, which works in the morpher, but also is can be equipped on the figure. But I'm super curious about the keys that come with the Tronic and Dark Buster. Yeah. They probably make their own sounds. I'm think. wondering if Dark Buster transforms with a morpher embrace as well and his they, own key. I hope they actually use these keys in the show. Right? Oh, because there's actually um, a little blurb of about, like there's more oh yeah let's read the, the let's read this here so when scientists convert the power of the morphing grid into morph x a what? group of teens are infused with animal dna hold on hold on so morph x is just enatron sure yeah they juiced the morphing grid yep they, they juiced it fuck a, a group of teens infused with animal dna to become the in in full caps Power Rangers Beast Morphers. And protect the Morph X from the villains who may try to steal it. No! It's it's no! It's I don't Trump. want no more villains that want to steal things. I like how it's just they may try to steal it. That's not necessarily going to steal it. Uh, <laughs> stop them. Okay. I'm getting Gar, sick of this. Gar, What's who, the problem? what villain wouldn't want the powers of the morphing grid? Uh, no, I'm just sick and Maybe Dark Buster exists because they did steal a part. Yeah, of exactly. No. They made an evil ranger. Uh, Dino Charge and Ninja Steel were just... What were the villain's goals? The oh, gotta get the things. Go, Busters. It, it's gotta a bomb! get that thing. It's a bomb. Get the things. <sighs> Grab all the things. I still yeah. want lunch. <laughs> uh, where, where was uh, it? Imagine the cyber villain Blaze and Tronic figures commanding the forces of Evox yeah, to steal the Morphex. And have the red, blue, and yellow ranger figures. Fighting. And no one else. <laughs> totally. There, there's totally no one else. Well, not yet. <laughs> oh, no. They'll probably show off gold and silver at Toy Fair next week. Toy Fair is next week? Oh, my gosh. I know. That's so exciting. All right. So, next story. I, I want this. What, what is it next week? Is it, like, Wednesday? We, we, no, it's, like, on a weekend. We have our first yeah, image usually of... Usually you start getting the first, the first, um... Leaks and stuff from like the middle of the week. Well, this is what this is. So we have our first right. image of the Beast Morphers Beast X Megazord. It's Go Buster. Yep. Yeah. So it's like not terrible to, to, to the to the yeah. So Go Buster is actually like my favorite like mech or like at least one of them because I think like honestly honestly I think in terms of like uh, mechs Sentai mechs my favorite's uh, Decker Ranger Robo. I love that thing. Yeah. Uh, but no, I love Gobustro. I just love its overall design. This, like, 
I, I, I thought I, I thought I was making a complaint that the legs looked a bit too skinny, but then it's not that the, the but my then, problem isn't that they're skinny. It's weird that the the ace parts of the legs are sticking out of them in the middle. You know what I mean? Yeah, well, that's always been a thing. Is it? Yeah. yeah so Gar showed Gar showed me a picture of like the DX Gobustero, and like yeah, apparently in even in that like the legs are still like decently skinny. So I'm like okay, but honestly, I'm happy because I finally get an affordable Gobustero that I can probably and honestly that looks good. It, it, it could have been a lot worse. And you want to know the worst part? There are still people complaining, like, oh, it's a brick. And it's like, guys, it's Hasbro's first year. Fuck off. If you want a brick, go buy Zuo King. It's three bricks. Oh. Huh. Well, right. Go buy all ten bricks. Yeah. It's fun. It's a it's, toy that it, does absolutely nothing. Yeah. No, wait, that's Perry the Platypus. Uh-huh. Where's Perry? All right. And also on the Megazord line is... The Power Rangers Beast Morphers Beast X Ultra Zord. Spoilers. It is a non-combining version of the ultimate combination featuring lights and sounds. Well, no, there because that's the DX <coughs> version, and then that's the one that with with uh, lights and sounds in it. Yeah. So it's funny that. Wow, this thing looks tall. It does look tall. <laughs> uh, that looks like it's not gonna be able to stand up on its own. Or fit on your shelf. <laughs> <laughs> You have to use the weapon to stabilize it, which is super... <clears throat> and then next, from Hasbro subsidiary Play School, is the again. Wild Force Megazord. Come again. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it has a four-legged bone! Uh, oh my god! Uh, <laughs> uh, excuse me? <laughs> what the fuck? That is my, my Megazord. That's the one I grew up with. That's yeah. right there. S First off, same. Second, <laughs> why Wild Force to start off? Because Wild Force. Because it's my. No, I'm kidding. It's not. I don't know. Wild Force go faster. Wild Force. <laughs> Wild Force. <laughs> I used to eat Fruit Loops and really fast, so I could get to school. Look at the weird after. smiley face it's got. <laughs> A Animus. Hey, hey guys, I'm here to fight evil. Animus is turning over in his grave right now. <laughs> and the fucking speaker is on its foot! <laughs> Gar, you know you're gonna buy this. I'm not gonna buy yes, this. Yes, you are. <laughs> you are. That's the closest to the Wild Force Megazord you'll ever get a for it. Oh. Oh. Uh, I... I'm so glad I didn't look at this beforehand. <laughs> Just I'm not gonna lie. Four legged mode. Four legged mode. You mean it's okay. bending over? I'm not gonna lie. I would actually like to see the, the hands look so fucking stupid. I would love to see the Astro Megazord like this. Oh my god, no! Please do not bastardize what about the Astro Turbo Megazord? Rescue Zord. No. Yes. Gonna... Magic King. Magic King they're is the do place it for full. every sword. Every sword. <laughs> The hands are just dangling on a little fucking... The oh bison sword's face, though, on the crotch. <laughs> oh. oh my god. And Blaze is losing it over Wild Force in our chat. All right. Blaze is just singing the fucking theme song. Yeah. <laughs> so both of these are scheduled for release in the fall. Yeah. Uh, well, the Ultra Zord is... I don't remember the theme song. Here's the funny thing. See this tall-ass Ultra Zord? That's $39. Then you look at this thing, the Wild Force Play School version, $60! Probably because it has electronics all through it. Yeah. Which means it's 70 here. No, but the, the Ultra Zord has lights and sounds. No, no, no. no again, sounds, different, but... different Ultra Zord. Because, okay, so go to the Ultra Zord fo photo. So the one on the left, that's 40 bucks. The one on the right, that will be 60 bucks. Because they aren't the same figure. No, but it says here, retail price for the Wild Force Megazord is fifty nine ninety nine. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no. Next news <laughs> story. What, what else we got about Power Rangers? Tokusatsu suit actor Hiyaki Kusaka announces his retirement. Well, okay, it's not Megazord related. Yeah. Not really. So, uh, longtime suit actor, say his name, because I'm Hideaki not going to Hiyaki Kusaka. Names, has announced that this weekend's final episode of Kaito Sentai Lupin Ranger vs. Keisat Sentai Pat Ranger will be his final performance in Tokusatsu. Kusaka has been a mainstay Kusaka. has been a mainstay in Super Sentai since 1980 with Denshin Sentai Denziman and has been a performer inside virtually all major Super Sentai mecha costumes. 
He is currently portraying both Lupin Kaiser and Pat Kaiser in Lupin Ranger vs. Pat Ranger. He's the man inside the machine. Yep. Uh, he was also Decca Master in Decca Ranger and Sho Rompo in Q Ranger. Wow. Oh, cool. So the thing. Cool. What a master. He has been the main mecha suit actor since 1980. Yikes. So every time you watch Power Rangers or Super Sentai, it was him. Cool. He was the guy taking the punches. He was the guy swinging the dynamic sword. He was the one getting tossed in the buildings. Unless it was CG. <laughs> Guess CGI lost him his job. <laughs> That's cool, though. All right. So, wait, how old is he then? If he's been doing this since 1940. E- or 1980. 1940. <laughs> Sorry, 19, 1980. 19-aught-40. <laughs> uh, wait. 19 diggity 2 1980, 90, 2000. <laughs> See, we couldn't, so, say, uh, dig- no, no. couldn't say number we couldn't 2 say back then. couldn't say 20 because the Nazis stole it. So, we say diggity. Something oh, like wow, that. 40? 49 years. That's a lot. Wait. Yeah, 49. He, to answer people in the chat, he's the chest and legs of the Megas. <laughs> chest and legs. <laughs> anyway, next. Mega Beast Empire is subbing Juco B Fighter. You know, Hooray! They were, they were also releasing, uh, gee, I don't know, uh, Kaiju Club. It's been a year since episode three, guys. It's only a four part miniseries. So, anyone who enjoyed Beetleborgs or didn't enjoy Beetleborgs and wants to see what the source material might be like, the first five episodes are sub and you can look them up. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. which uh, the fan subbers did say that they will be releasing one new episode a week. We'll see how successful that is. Well, they said that they actually have a few episodes already done. All right. Well, fine. I'm glad. Go ahead. Next, Bandai's DX Ride Watch poll enters preliminary round. So, I think this is the second round of voting. Yeah. Okay. So, so just for the record, <clears throat> no no, no one apparently voted enough for Kuga and Agito. Because we already have ride watches of them. Well, what about all the other forms for Kuga? What about Gills, G3X, freaking G4, another Agito? I would like Gills. But anyways, so there, were th- there are 307 candidates that fans can vote for, which includes forms and riders... From the many shows and movies, <clears throat> while fans are still able to vote for all of those in the second round. No, J- Jay isn't in the running. He's a show writer. Uh, we have, yeah, this is about Heisei writers. Yeah. So we have a list here of the top most voted candidates so far. So we got Scissors and Oja from Ryuki. Okay, okay, Oja makes sense. But scissors? scissors? He died in two episodes. Well, like, like I'm a, <laughs> even I'm a fan of Ryuki, and I'm like, really, Scissors? That's the a first r- one to get the axe? That's a way. No, G is not in the running. G is technically not a common rider. I would love G. He is a parody of a different company that Toei helped with. Can, so, you well, just all, the, all these guys are in, in, in the running to be watches in a special set, right? Yeah, yeah. a DX ride watch set. Yes. You know, now that we're thinking about it, I would love for there just like a few years from now just to be a rider for every letter of the alphabet. Because we've got G, J, X, double. <laughs> W. You mean double? Yeah. I've been saying it wrong for the last that's 10 how, years. That's how the Japanese say the word, the letter W. Yeah, oh. alright. So for, so yeah, for Ryuki, you got Scissors and Oja. For Fize, you got Kamen Rider Fize. Axel Form. Axel Form. And so Orga. selling a Kiva belt for, for almost $300. Oh, on Amazon. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> Fize Axel Form is a perfect fit for a ride watch because his power, that form comes from a watch. So I would love that. Yeah, Kamurai or Oga make or Orga, Orga, or, Orga. yeah, Orga makes sense. You know, you know, his actor passed away. Yeah. Would be nice to have some of them. And apparently, his figure is only going for sixty six dollars on Amazon right now. Cool, it's, it's on actually. my wish list. Kamen Rider Blade, you got Kamen Rider Chalice because she yeah. was a really fan favorite. So was Kamen Rider Kabuto, or or so Kick- was Kamen Rider. Kick Wait, Hopper. let's just we don't even mention the series. Just yeah. say the name. Kick Hopper also. From- Yep. Apparently, no writers from Hibiki made it. Shocking. That that is a bit disappointing. Yeah, that's what I meant. Not shocking, but disappointing. So basically, nobody. No, no, we're getting to it. All right for for Deno, it's Deno Cho Climax Form. Kiva, it's Dark Kiva. Give me new new Deno Vega Form, you fucking cowards! The end makes no sense because it's the end complete form. I'm shocked. I'm genuinely shocked the incomplete form is like, on this list. 
Well, no, I mean, I like it, but I assume most of the fandom hated it. Did you not see what was... Like, they had everything down on this list. Wow. Like, yeah, there were 300 of them. Like, everything. No, I'm not not shocked that it was on the list. I'm shocked that it's in the most voted list. Like, like, Gaim Wizard Armor was a list. Was on the poll list. Jesus. That's how... That is weirdly specific. That is weirdly specific. Uh, So, going down this list, I'm excited about this one. Kamen Rider Double Cyclone Excel Extreme. There you Don't go. You have, the rider that never existed. Don't you have the figure out I for do that? have the figure out of them. Yeah. yeah. Then yeah. you got Kamen Rider Skull and Eternal, which... Both, both good choices. Both good choices. Kamen Rider O's Super Tatuba form. Of all of the forms in O's, which are all amazing, Super Tatuba is the one that tops the list? No fucking way! Why? What's wrong with that form? I don't like it! Wait, Super Tatuba? You don't like yes, Super Tatuba? I love no. Super Tatuba. So, so, yeah. Why not Sugosa Puto Tera? Well, Puto Tera's getting right right. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Give me Sugosa, damn it! No, I'm sorry. Just the way that you immediately cut yourself off. To <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Why so, not Tasha? Don't wait. They did that one. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> Forzane Wizard got skipped, so fuck Nagesh... 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 Yeah. And then fuck White Wizard or any of the major. Oh, I would love White Wizard! Or Sorcerer. Um, it's Kamen yeah. Rider Wiseman. How about you Kamen Rider fuck so, off? True. No, <laughs> no, no, and get this. Kamen Rider Guy, a fan favorite in the 15th anniversary series. Nothing from that series made this list. That Nothing. is super weird. I this... want Bravo and Duke, damn it! No, this list is heavily disappointing. Right? For Drive, you got Kamen Rider Mock Chaser. And then, and just, then this is the giant. I'm sorry, but and just to clarify, Mock Chaser is the blue one from the movie, so, aka the ugly so one. So for the X Eight ride no, no, watches, also, I, it's blue and I hate it. That's also, how bad it is. Also, there is no ghost. So there is no like nothing came for ghost. So for X Eight, we got Kamen Rider Gemu Zombie Gamer <laughs> Level X, Kamen Rider Gemu Zombie Action Gamer Level X Zero, Kamen Rider Gemu God Maximum Gamer Level Billion, right, Kamen Rider no, Poppy, no. and Kamen Rider Cronus. All the Genmus. Fuck. The- you <laughs> fuck Genmu for fuck sake! I want a level billion one. You're telling me out of three hundred and seven, two of them with the exact same damn face <laughs> got made it to the top twenty. It'll, There's literally no difference say, in a ride watch because the only difference is the belt. Yeah, it is just their face. There is no difference. But he's got a new belt. <laughs> Can you fucking imagine if they did release both of them? No, no, and I wouldn't be that disappointed. How would you even no, know? No, no, you know, I wouldn't be that disappointed if each, if at least one writer from each show made the list, right? But hang on, Kuga, Agito, Hibiki, freaking um, uh, freaking Forze, Wizard, Guy, Ghost, seven seasons. Didn't make the cut because fucking everybody was like, oh, I love you. Yeah, and Grotto. Derp, 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 he's so weeby. Derp, 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 derp. Okay, okay. Fuck him. Okay. We reached peak gar. And finally, Kamen Rider cross charge because fuck me. You right there, Gar? Sorry, just fuck off. I know, you hate Genmu. This is such bullshit. Oh, people love Genmu, man. Did he get, like, chosen, like, four times or something? Three times! Well, yeah, three different times. This is pretty amazing. Four if you count Cronus. <laughs> Just... <laughs> 20 years. That's a long time for a franchise to go on for. That's true. There is a hundred plus... Like, almost 200 plus riders there with all unique characters. And they choose one guy because, oh, he's so funny even though he's not. I mean, I mean, I'm going to bed. bed. I mean, I think he's funny, but I agree it's a little overkill. Don't go to bed, guard. Go to bed. Go to the show. <laughs> We've only got one more, one more story. One more story. Oh, 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 this better be important. It's pretty important. Hasbro and Paramount in talks for Power Rangers movie sequel. Ooh, give me my sequel, damn it! It no, hang on. It doesn't say sequel. Well, it's it a, just a says new movie. movie. It better be a fucking sequel. Reboot it again. <laughs> Do what I you, want Billy no, back no, now! No, no, you I want my Billy back, Billy back, Billy back, Billy back ribs. No, no. You Chitty Billy back ribs. Treaty Billy back. No, no, you know what? You know what? Do what they did in Bumblebee. Take all the good parts of that movie. <laughs> Put those in the trash. <laughs> no, 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 take all the good things from the movie and put it into the sequel. 
Hey, you Getting like? a sequel. We're doing oh. Power Rangers, the second part. <laughs> Power Rangers. Yeah. Also, go see Lego Movie Two. It was a rocking movie. Because this like song's gonna no, get it'd be, it'd be Power you. Rangers <laughs> Two, more Electric Boogaloo. Electric Billy Lou. Secret of the Blues. I've been seeing the movie it. already. No. That, but... <laughs> Anyways, um, makes sense. Hasbro and Paramount do all their movies together. You got the Transformers, GI Joe, um, My Little Pony. We um, do not mention that in this room. Hey. Um, actually, yeah, don't oh, forget the side of me. They're actually in, They're actually in the talks of making a mask, a mask show or mask movie. Ooh, cool. Mask. No, 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 not. The Jim Carrey one. No, I Fuck. The, the 80s series mask. Yeah, okay. You know what you're talking about. Fuck! Trust me, I know what you're talking <laughs> right, um, about. Dungeons and Dragons. If it doesn't have Jim Carrey, I don't carry! Uh, that was cute. Hey, um, did, you, did you forget <laughs> that the Jim Carrey's playing robotic? Yeah, the Sonic movie. movie. I am more... I have not been more emotionally torn about a movie in my fucking life! I to see that movie! I don't wanna... <laughs> yes, we are. I'll buy your ticket. We'll wait, go see it in IMAX. Wait, wait. It couldn't be a sequel. <laughs> well, uh, Blaze. Yes! You know what? Confirmed. We are going to see Sonic the Hedgehog the movie in IMAX. Oh, God. Do it. I'm, I'm, now, hang on. Blaze. Yes, you do mention, oh, but it's owned by Lionsgate. Technically, no. Lionsgate just made the movie. Hasbro owns the initial rights to the, the movie. Like, like, to the franchise altogether. The movie. That includes the movie. The movie. But anyways, that's it for news. That was a long ass. That was news. a long news list. My throat's now sore because of Genmu. Uh, I'm, I'm so <laughs> <laughs> Got my, <got> my <laughs> Oh, sweet, a cookie. No, fuck you. <laughs> so the short version is Dan Kuroto throat yeah. fuck car. Thank you, bro, for listening. Have a good night, and we'll hear you on the podcast proper. Talk to you later. Don't say that. Damn, when am I gonna get the VR troopers? That's not real. <laughs>